Intro. Hi, friend. <laughs> Hello. Welcome to Quinn and Jack Goof Off. It's been a long time since we've done one of these. Yes, it has. It has been a significant amount of time. And honestly, I'm pretty... Pretty welcome, hype. Welcome back. Welcome back. Quinn and Jack Goof Off. It's been yeah. a while since we've used that, that podcast cover. Mm. So, I've had an idea for this, this episode. Yes. Uh, and I have not told you this. Uh, you have not. So, oh, it's just it's just Quinn and I, by the way. It's only me. Quinn and me, grammatically. It's only Quinn and me today. No, isn't it? It's Quinn and I. It is, it is only Quinn and me. Because if you take out Quinn and, it is only me today. It is only I today. <laughs> Tis only I. I have figured that I was wrong. Tis me. <laughs> Tis me. Only me. Only mine. It's only me today. So, um, it's Quinn and me today. Yes. And... Uh, we're in Rossman's back room. Thank you, Rossman. Appreciate it. So, I have been writing down over the past three days. This week. We'll say this week. Mm-hmm. It is, we're recording this on a Friday. Yes. I have been writing down every wiki page that I visited during class. Okay, this is a fire. This is fire. Yeah. I don't even know what you're going <laughs> to say next, and this is fire. So, so, I feel like it would just be a very good bouncing or uh what's the word i'm looking for just like ricocheting good, off each other trampoline pad what's the what's it, uh springboard 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 a good springboard for conversation because i just have so many it, just like the most random things it's just very random things and i and you can see like the stream of consciousness from how i go from one oh, thing oh another. so like you went to one and then like you would click like another link it you within found links and like learn yeah, yeah, yeah so yeah, i can yeah, talk yeah. about what i learned about in each of these oh, things and i can yeah. kind of explain why i went to each of the wiki pages let's get right into it let's get right into I, it. this sounds very interesting yeah and fun. speaking of uh I, I go on a lot of wiki pages i just read nerd wiki pages. that's <laughs> a lot of so people say that to have like a big vocabulary or like to be good at writing and stuff which are Two, two things, things that, that you are good at. I'm pretty good at. Objectively good at. And people are like, oh, to do those things, you you must read a lot of books. And I'm like, no, I hate reading books yes, so much. Books I'm actually suck. reading a book right now, and I'm proud of myself for it. But Double nerd. <laughs> Come on. No. But I don't I don't read books. I just re- read wiki pages and learn about the most random things. That's honestly smart. I might need That's to do all that. I do. People will be like playing games on their iPad. I'm just like reading wiki pages. Going to scroll through wikis. I'm just like scrolling through wikis. So... Wiki, Wiki, Wikipedia is the only like favorited tab on my. <laughs> it's the only source of information oh, ever. Ever, no, yeah. <laughs> but speaking of which, uh, uh-huh. back in the day, remember when it was like, oh, you're writing a paper, mm-hmm. do not use Wikipedia. It's still like that. It is not. Well, it's still like don't use Wikipedia. Yeah, but it, it is more of a credible source, I would say. Well, yeah, because then, then in like 2014. The, yeah, the thing is that like the people that uphold the wiki pages actually care about what they they're do typing care a about. significant amount so like if someone messes it up they're going to change it back because they care about exactly because they care about who's writing about the annoying orange yes on the they, they care page. about jonah's ark yeah noah's ark but yes i thought there was another thing I don't jonah know. is the whale guy i think i combined like two things i think one of them was from the bible one of them was definitely from both the bible. of them are from the bible well, no no really? but i think i think i took jonah from something else oh that wasn't from the bible it was floating around in my head well, you might be thinking okay there's two bible stories that you might be thinking about there's there's noah's ark yeah you know, i know that two one, by obviously. two animal yeah, 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 on, yeah, yeah. on the, that one's something cubits amount of wood yes and then uh different bible story jonah and the whale where where jonah gets he's like God is like, go to Nineveh, Jonah. Well, that's the thing. I've never heard that. And then he ever. gets swallowed by a big old whale. This is actually in the Bible. Mm-hmm. He gets swallowed by the whale. He like lives in the whale for like three days. And then the whale just like opens up his mouth or something like that. He, he just like, walks crawls out. out. Something like that. Why did he do that? Just, I don't know, teach Jonah a lesson. <laughs> what did he do bad? <laughs> he, did, he didn't want to go to Nineveh and preach to the sinners, I think. That piece of crap. That, that piece of crap, right. Jonah. Anywho... So yeah, you're sorry about that little uh, <laughs> un- side, un- uneducated. And we're not gonna get through all of these. Oh, I, yeah. I know we're not gonna get. This is the past week, uh-huh. so we're not getting through all yeah. of these. But if if you have any interjections, or, I, or like I will any, say it. any different paths to go down of conversation, we can do this for several episodes. Yes, I'm sure. yes. So, the no, well, first, and it's like it's like infinite. 
because I assume really you will is. keep I'm going keep to more wikis. A hundred percent. So the, yeah. the list will just get longer and longer. Yeah, we'll need a new podcast. Coming. Yeah. It's just like the yeah. wiki chronicles. <laughs> it's just a wiki. Yeah, that's it's, it. It's just a Wikipedia. It's just logo. a Wikipedia logo. <laughs> so okay. The first, the first one on my list mm-hmm. is list of Disney Channel original films. Okay, <laughs> is what I visited. Okay, um, I don't remember what the context was for why I visited it. You just wanted. I to. think it was during choir class, and we were talking about like Descendants. Someone was yes, I remembered the and then conversation. I was like, Yo, was Teen Beach movie, because that's a banger. Yes, you told me about that. Yeah, I did tell you about Teen Beach Two, yeah. Ross Lynch. Oh yeah, 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 but um, yeah, we were talking about that, and then what, what are some other? Te- Disney Channel original bangers. I, I never watched. Are you not a Disney I, Channel original? Film it's not guy? that I wasn't. Uh, I, I'm just not a film guy in general. I don't like I'm movies. I'm really not really. either. But There's, I just happened to watch them because they were on TV. Yeah. Like um, Descendants. I was not a big Descendants guy when it came out, but I can uh, I can appreciate it. I, know I hate the sequels though. There's like two that I've ever watched, and I did watch Radio Rebel before all the oh, all the hype came out. Radio and, Rebel's a banger. Yes, oh, <laughs> that went goodness. crazy. Let me go to the wiki page. And then, uh, I, love I don't that. know. There's, there's one more. Uh, I'm sure. Maybe, I don't know. Is it, like, Zapped or something with Zendaya? There's a lot of, like, 90s films that I have no idea what's going on. Uh-huh. Uh, High School Musical, good one. High School Musical. I don't, like, I don't think I've good. ever seen a High School Musical. You ever seen Camp Rock? Yes, I've Camp definitely Rock. seen Camp uh, Rock. She's really good. <laughs> uh, Wizards of Waverly Place, the movie. I, so. I barely watched Wizards of Waverly Place, like the series. If I'm being honest, I couldn't tell you a single thing about Wizards and the Waverly Place. Selena Gomez is the star of that. I've heard of her uh, before. Camp Rock 2, The Final Jam. I don't, I've never watched that. I think I have, but I don't remember it. I'm going to be honest with you. Lemonade Mouth. I've... See, I never watched that when I was a kid, but there's that Danny Gonzalez video that I watched. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do, 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 do. Phineas and Ferb, the movie. I've, I've watched, I watched that That's on Netflix. Good, the Second Dimension? That was sick. Ooh. Good luck, Charlie. It's Christmas. Frenemies. Oh, my God. That brings me back. That's between <laughs> Zendaya and, oh, what's her name? Radio Rebel. Bella. Oh, uh, what? Oh. Uh, Bella Thorne. Uh, they were on Shake It Up together. And oh, I didn't know that. And they were in a movie called Frenemies. I've heard of Shake It Up, I think. Radio Rebel, good one. That's a good one. Cloud Nine. Actually, no, 2013, Teen Beach movie. Very good movie. <laughs> Cloud Nine with Dove Cameron. Never Dove heard Cameron of that. Was a, a Zapped single thing. with Zendaya. How to Build a Better Boy. That had China and McLean in it, didn't it? You know China and McLean? No, I she thought was she was. A, you said China, and I thought she was on Ant Farm. I thought you meant China. There's a lot. No, China, China. <laughs> Bad hair. I uh, barely remember. Teen Beach movie two, good one. Descendants, and then it gets into like movies that I have not seen. That are just that are like, just like too recent. Like Unks. Oh, I like thought you zombies. Meant like, Screw zombies. I watched zombies. I watched part I of zombies watch once. Zombies. It's terrible. It's horrible. Everything nowadays is terrible. Everything nowadays is terrible. Next. Yes. Next on my wiki pages. Next on uh, Nile Rodgers. You know Nile Rodgers? He's a uh, he's so. a rhythm guitarist for Chic. Oh, he's, he's what a some, guy. Some crazy guitarist. He's produced a lot man. of tracks. He's so good. So so you did you get from the No, the that's dis- completely okay, separate. Okay. I was like But speaking of mm-hmm. the next so wiki pages, Nile Rodgers, uh-huh. Chic, the band he was in, yeah. and then Chic discography. Is yeah, yeah. The so three so, wiki page run. So you, yeah, you were you were really invested in this man. Yes, I yeah, I was really paying attention to the discography and everything. Chic, cool history. Uh-huh. Bernard Edwards on bass, very See, cool. That's the thing. You know a lot more stuff. I'd say in general. That's because I visit wiki pages. Exactly. About it. I read the history of spoons. If I, if I feel like exactly, that. you're bored. Just read the history of spoons. Exactly. Dude. Just because. Uh, next wiki page. Michael Jackson albums discography. I've heard of that guy before. You've heard of Michael Jackson? <laughs> yes. That's I've important. definitely heard of that guy. That's before. really good to know. Yes. <laughs> His album's discography, very pretty good. He made like Billy John. He did me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. He did make Billy John. <laughs> He's Billy known John. for that Billy yeah. John. Billy John. So Michael Jackson album's discography. The Jackson Five. That's the one that was he was, he was a kid. In, he was in the Jackson Five. Little yeah. kid. For sure. When he was a little kid. Yes. Well and so then, Hmm? So, is he the oldest or the youngest? He's the or, youngest. Bro, his four older brothers must feel terrible. I'm sure. Well, they're, they're probably just like, yeah. But 
well, I mean, I was since, dead. So. I'm assuming since the beginning, Michael was like the front man of it because it was like, oh, he's singing. He's a little kid. He's singing his little heart out. Yeah, going, and Ow. and then now he's a teenager. And now he's singing really good. Actually, yeah, now, he's, now he's an adult. And now he's actually just the front man of the Jackson yeah. Five doing the robot and stuff. And now all his brothers are worthless because yeah. now he's Michael Jackson. Do you know that Michael Jackson like popularized the robot dance move? Really? Yeah, he did. And the moonwalk, obviously. But, yeah, because like, he was. He was cracked at that he, moonwalk. He I popularized the robot. There's he popularized things, like so many things. There's his some songs. things that like <laughs> he did popularize. His yeah. Song. There's some things that I don't realize are not like old and have been around forever. Mm-hmm. Like I think Steve Martin coined air quotes uh-huh. with his fingers in like the 70s. And yeah. I'm like, that hasn't been around forever. That's crazy. See, this is like kind of the opposite. When I was a kid, I thought Michael Jackson died in like 1970. Really? He died <laughs> yeah. in 09. I he? know. I was alive when he yeah. died. I was a year old. And then when I was five, I thought he died like 20 years ago. The high five started in the late 70s. The, it, it, was that with the high five? The high five started in oh, the late like 70s. Oh, like the move. High the five. The A Started in the late 70s. That started in the 70s? Isn't that crazy? What did they do beforehand? At, my father lived in a time before the <sighs> high five. Isn't that crazy? Shout out to Dwayne. Wait, that's crazy. I know. Dwayne, I feel bad for you. <laughs> <laughs> what would you do before high five? How do you endear know. your friend? The fist bumps, I guess. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like a fist bump definitely came after a high five. I don't know. I feel like it's a secondary to the high five. Well, then what did they do before a high five? I don't know. They they probably they just shook hands. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like losers. Did. Good job, man. <laughs> yeah, good job. Shake hands. Nice crisp handshake. Nice crisp handshake. Yeah, that's weird. I know. So further on my wiki yes. pages, from the Jackson Five, I went to Tito Jackson. Tito Jackson was one of the Jackson Five members, and he died recently. I think. Oh, R.I.P. Rip Tito. Yes. I think he was one of the older ones. I want to say, but uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. And then from there, I was on, like, the, like, music kick, and so I uh-huh. went to Earth, Wind, and Fire. Oh, I've heard of them before. You know, Earth, Wind, and Fire? Yeah. Speaking of which, I did not celebrate the 21st night of September, and I feel bad about it. Yeah, because that's, the, cause that's their one song. Yeah, the, in September. Hi, hi. That one. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, that's such a good song. That's in my top 100 songs of all time. I have a oh. list of my top 100 songs of all time. So you would say 90% of them, and I probably wouldn't know them. That's for a different podcast. That is. That's going to be a podcast I'm like, ah, I don't know what that is. <laughs> it's just going to be me reading, reading a song and you going, don't know it. Yeah, for that's cool, I guess. Different and songs. then you'll say like, Cake by the Ocean. And I'll be like, yeah. <laughs> Cake by the Ocean is not on my top <laughs> oh, 100 songs. I would hope that. not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. So from Earth, Wind, and Fire, uh-huh. I read about like their history. Very interesting. Mm-hmm. And then I went to the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. And then also their list of Rock and Roll Hall of Fame inductees. Uh huh. Because I've been to that wiki page a thousand times. Yeah. I swear to God. Do, do you, are you flabbergasted each one? <laughs> Every single time. I'm like, oh my You're God, like, LL Cool Oh my God. I can't, I can't believe, I can't Cougie. believe it. Etta James? No way. <coughs> you know? Sorry, I coughed. Uh, it's okay, man. <laughs> <laughs> I respect it. Sorry for the viewers. All the viewers, yeah. Yes. Sorry for the listeners. <laughs> oh, yeah, listeners. I'm sorry. I'm messing it up. Man. <laughs> and then from there, I was just on a bunch of different people in. <laughs> For all of the listeners, uh, um, Quinlan just squirted some Germex on his hand and it went everywhere. It actually exploded. It ricocheted off For his second, hand I thought it was and my sprayed eye, on And me. then I was like, oh, I have glasses on. So I was chilling. <laughs> but. <laughs> that was. Oh, my God. It's got every. That was impressive. Honestly. That was honestly. Okay, uh, back do to <laughs> do it. Do it again. <laughs> From the list of rock and roll Hall of Fame inductees, I was just on a bunch of different Hall of Fame inductees. So I went to like John Lee Hooker, Curtis Mayfield, uh-huh. The Impressions, which Curtis Mayfield was a member of, and then I went to Eric Clapton. Eric Clapton. I've heard of him before. Eric Clapton is like one of those classic. One of the best guitarists of all time. Yeah. And then... He just goes crazy. He just goes crazy. And he's been in like a thousand different bands. Mm. Uh, and I went to a couple of wiki pages of the bands. But is he still alive? I think he's still alive. Okay. I want to say he is, but very good. And then I was like on a kick of listening to 
just Eric Clapton <laughs> yeah. for a little bit, and like Derek and the Dominoes. Just a riffing on Dominoes. Derek, Derek and, and the, the Domino- Dominoes. What groups was he part of? Derek and the Dominoes. He was in Cream. He was in the Yardbirds. He had a solo. So Eric Clapton mm-hmm. is the only person to be inducted into the Hall, uh, Rock and Roll Hall of Fame uh-huh. three times. Oh, from like three different from bands? From three different bands. Okay, that's Because he was inducted for the Yardbirds, Cream, and then for his solo career. Oh, see, and that's, that's very impressive. It's very impressive. Like as well. There have been a handful of people who have been inducted twice, uh-huh. like Michael Jackson. He was inducted for the Jackson yeah, 5, yeah, the Jackson 5 and, and for then, his solo career. But he's the only person to ever do three. Eric Clapton's the only person to ever do three. And it's kind of crazy. That is, that's very impressive, i got to say. It's pretty cool. That shout he, out Eric Clapton. Shout out Eric Clapton. Good job. You're doing good things. Let me let me go to the wiki page because I love <laughs> this wiki page. List of Rock and Roll Hall of Fame inductees. So there's like so there's the whole list with mm-hmm. everyone that like and everyone that inducted them. And then that's the whole list of everyone inducted into the Rock Also a Hall lot. Wait, does, does it go by like the by, farther you go down, is it older? No, it's per year. There's like a yearly ceremony uh-huh. of who who's inducted. Who's the first ever inducted? The is first that... ever inductees were. It I'm was, not gonna know. Them. It was started in the year 1986. Oh, that's way earlier I than I thought it would the be. The thing about it is that you have to be in the music industry for 30 years, and then you can be inducted into the Hall uh... of Fame. So there's several people who like they were inducted the first year that they like became eligible for it yeah well so d- yeah, does that mean was michael jackson like did his the jackson 5 was inducted 30 years after, after... their first song came out i think oh, okay and then michael jackson his solo, his solo career, career was then 30 years after yeah, he had done it i believe okay but he was he he had a he came out with his first album when he was a kid by himself. Yeah, yeah. Oh, by himself, really? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Speaking of which, not speaking of Michael Jackson, but uh-huh. speaking of the uh, inductees of the Hall of Fame. Yes. Sheik, the band with Nile Rodgers that was a previous wiki page, uh-huh. Sheik has had the most nominations to be inducted that hasn't been inducted. They've had like 11 nominations to be inducted. Oh, but they haven't the ever been inducted. They've never been inducted. So the inaugural class of the... Hall of Fame. Was it yes. 1986? Chuck Berry. You know Chuck Berry? Nope. That's unfortunate. James Brown. No. Nope. Ray Charles. I've heard of him, maybe. <sighs> Sam Cooke. I've heard of him, maybe. Fats Domino. Okay. I don't know him, but I want to know him. <laughs> that <laughs> the, sounds sick. The Everly Brothers? Nope. You don't know the Everly Brothers? I do not think so. Oh. Buddy Holly? There's not that one the, Weezer the, song. The, <laughs> no, he not, wasn't not the Weezer song. Didn't he like? Was he one of those three that like died in the plane crash? He was one of the three that died the day the music died. Jerry Lee Lewis. No. Nope. Little Richard. No, nope. but see, that's I also like Little Richard. Cool and guy. Elvis Presley. I think I've heard of him. You think? <laughs> no, I've heard of him. <laughs> I've heard of that guy. You've definitely heard of him. My grandma used to love Elvis. She'd like play him on the record player. Really? And I'd be like, oh, this is cool. I guess. So here's all of the people. The people that have been inducted for two different things. There's a lot of people. Oh, for double time. For Who have been inducted two times. Uh-huh. Like, you know, Peter Gabriel. He was in Genesis and then in his solo career. I heard of Genesis. Here, uh, Dave Grohl. Oh, Dave Grohl's been inducted yeah, didn't, twice. Something, didn't he do something bad recently? He I did. Think. He, like, cheated yeah. on his wife, I think. Oh, yeah. But he was in Nirvana and then Foo Fighters. They were inducted. Oh, see, I did not know Dave Grohl was in Nirvana. He was, yeah. He was, was the drummer. He? Oh, see, that's yeah. mm-hmm. the more you know, I guess. Yeah. George Harrison, all of the Beatles, I think, have been inducted twice for their. That would make sense for their like the Beatles and then their solo careers. Because you know they're the Beatles. Because they're the Beatles. I think Ringo Starr was inducted for the Beatles. But Ringo. Then Ringo, he was the drummer, but then he was the Beatles, and then I think he got like an award of excellence or something because he doesn't. Oh, that's really, sick. Yeah, uh, John Lennon, Curtis Mayfield, who I mentioned previously, Stevie Nicks. Fleetwood Mac. Oh, I've heard of Fleetwood Solo Mac. Group. See, I've heard of like all these bands because they're like the yeah. really popular bands. But Ozzy just... Osbourne. You heard oh, of Ozzy I've heard Osbourne. of that guy. Ozzy Osbourne. He was in Black Sabbath as well. Yeah, so I've he heard got of Black inducted Sabbath. for Solo and Black Sabbath. Most of these are like being inducted for for both solo career and a band that they and, were and in. like the really popular band. Yeah, like Paul Simon, Simon and Garfunkel, 
And it's oh, so yeah, good. I've heard of Simon. Garfunkel is such a funny name. Art Garfunkel is his name. <laughs> Garfunkel. Art Garfunkel. What a, Tina Turner, Neil Young, a lot of people. And so Eric Clapton was the, the is, only is one. the only person to have been nominated three. See, or that's impressive. Awarded. Award, yeah. Or inducted the one, three yeah. different times. That's very impressive. 1992, 1993, and 2000. Yardbirds, Cream, and Solo. You think if he started making, if he started another band, he could do it again? He's been in so many bands. He's been in several other bands. Wait. So. Honestly, it might. Okay, hear me out. I have a hack to get on this a billion times. Uh, <laughs> Him, so, if first off, you just you just take, like, four people from all of, like, that have been on this list before that are obviously mm-hmm. amazing at band? what they do. Yes. And they then just <laughs> And then just, like, slowly rotate out people for other people that have been on the list. You ever heard of the Plastic Ono Band? No. That's one of the wiki pages that I, that oh. I visit, by the way. so <laughs> That's an amazing transition. Straight up. Okay, so Eric Clapton. Then I went to the Order of British Empire, which is straight up when somebody's like knighted, I think. They're called like Sir. So Eric Clapton is like Sir Eric Clapton, I think. Oh, because he's been knighted. That's all. I think I don't know if it's knighted or just like the queen is like. You are the queen's like, oh, you're sick, yeah, dude. Yeah, but now it would be the she's, king. Yeah, speaking okay, of which, yeah, oh. she's dead. So <laughs> Plastic Ono Band. Uh-huh. The Plastic Ono Band is a band that John Lennon, Ever heard of John Lennon? Yes, I've definitely heard of John One Lennon. One of the Beatles. Yeah. So John Lennon made this He's, band. You can cut this out. He's the one that got shot at his door, right? He did get shot at his door. I'm not yeah. cutting that out, but he did. He's dead. Okay. So he and Yoko Ono, uh-huh. who was his wife after he cheated on his wife with Yoko Ono. Sick. And say what you want about Yoko Ono. Honestly, I'm fine if you say anything about it. <laughs> you can say and actually anything. Um. So... He and Yoko Ono started a band, and they mm-hmm. just straight up like cycled in and out. Eric Clapton was once in the Plastic Ono band, yeah. so um, I then went from Plastic Ono band wiki page uh-huh. to list of members in the Plastic Ono band. Oh, and there's just gonna be a billion. Who were some of the? Okay, let me go to the let me go to the lineups. So John Lennon and Yoko Ono were always in it. Mm-hmm. Here's here's just some names who were in it. Uh-huh. There was Derek Clapton, Eric Clapton. Why did I say? Okay, Derek? I was I was like, is that his cousin? Eric or something? Clapton, and he and I guess they I don't know they went by like nicknames or something like that because then it just says underneath quotes Derek Clapto. <laughs> <laughs> Derek Clapto. <laughs> so um, wait, that's sick. <laughs> Derek. Alan White went by Dallas White. Ringo Starr was in it oh. just because he he's dude. Ringo Starr played on. Every one of the Beatles solo albums. Yeah, he was because he was friends with that band. Yeah, George Harrison, who was the guitarist in the Beatles. Oh, and he went by George Harrison, I guess. Billy Preston, you ever uh, heard of Billy Preston? No, I don't think so. Okay, he went by P- Billy Prestud. Okay, I gotta be honest; these names are stupid. Billy Preston? Who? Who? No, no, they're little <laughs> nicknames. <laughs> I know. Changing like three letters. That's what I'm be original. Thinking. Yeah, Come on Jim now. Gordon, Jim Boredom, cool. Yeah, you're uh, boring. Robert Gies, like it just names like that. Phil Spector was in it, I guess. But there's just like a big old li- Frank Zappa. You ever heard of Frank Zappa? Very good guitarist. Um, just like a list oh of all gosh. of the people who were just like cycled in and out. Yeah. And then there's a timeline of who was in, in what. That's like the most complicated thing I've ever seen. Yeah. <laughs> so that list of plastic ono band lineups. Then I went back to the wiki page of Eric Clapton just because I. Because you're like, this there. is a cool dude. Yeah. So that's that. Uh-huh. And then, I that's that wiki page, like, stream of consciousness, right? Yeah. So then, I went to, this is within government class. I went to a, a president, United States presidential approval ratings okay. wiki page. This sounds something like I can wrap my head around more. Mm-hmm. So the approval ratings of them. So what their highest approval rating during mm-hmm. their term there's a good graph on here yeah, of the high, graph. a good table of like highest approval rating, lowest approval rating, average approval rating, like distance, like a bunch of different data. Yeah, all the data, data that you need. So I just like sorted because people in class were just like, no, Trump wasn't the lowest. And I was like, he was, I think he had the lowest approval rating. He never broke 50%. Actually? <laughs> yeah, he never broke 50% approval rating. So, uh, yeah, he was the... He had the lowest average presidential approval rating of all the presidents. It's a fun fact. 
And then that is a fun fact. So then, I think the highest approval rating in general was Bush right after nine eleven. Oh yeah, cause because everyone like, was like bringing the country together. Yeah, that was ninety two percent. Holy flip! Rating. And I think he also had a really low approval rating around like the housing crisis. That makes sense. So he had a very diverse. Yeah. Where <laughs> time. okay, so obviously like George Washington isn't on this list. No, I think it started in nineteen thirty seven. Where do you think George Washington would have been ranked? George Washington. His would have been super high. I think a lot of people liked Washington. Yeah, but probably. I guess I don't think it'd be super duper high. What do you think about Abe? I think Abe. <laughs> Abe. I think a lot of people didn't I think, like Abe. Yeah, well, just because you know there was the whole South versus the Do North. Do you want to hear thing. a really fun fact about Abe Lincoln? Yes. About about Lincoln, Nebraska. Didn't he? Didn't he like? Uh, didn't he like line cut down a tree? Is that Washington? That was Washington. Oh, okay. Fun fact about Nebraska: mm-hmm. Lincoln was named. You'd think it was like, oh, we're gonna name this town after Lincoln because we like Lincoln. Yeah. What they did, so it was a big debate mm-hmm. on what's going to be the capital of Nebraska, Lincoln or Omaha. <coughs> Good cough. Thank you. So, <laughs> it was what's going to be the what's going to be the capital, Lincoln or Omaha? Mm-hmm. And the Omaha people were like, "We should be it. How can we discourage people for voting for this town?" Uh-huh. And they were like, "Let's get them to name it Lincoln, because people don't like Lincoln around oh. here." Because he freed the slave. Yeah. So, and so they named it Lincoln. Lincoln still won. <laughs> well, let's go. So well, the town of Lincoln was not named Lincoln because they liked him. It was named Lincoln because they because didn't, they like, didn't him. like him. Well, they thought that they didn't. They wouldn't like him. Yeah, and they still voted Lincoln to be fun fact. That's well, nice. Like genuine. Honestly, I do fact. wish they went for Omaha. Not because of I don't like Lincoln. It's just like I wanted population. one big major city. Yeah, we do have a big major city. Uh, Omaha is the bigger city. Well, yeah, but I wish uh, I wish it was just one huge city and then nothing else in Nebraska. <laughs> I think that'd be a lot. We do better. have like two cities. Though, yes, but, and then like Kearney. And then yeah, Kearney and Grand Island. Yeah, that's about it. Yeah. <laughs> then so presidential approval rating, opinion polling of Donald Trump administration. So just like polling specifically on Trump's administration, mm-hmm. and then. List of the most populous counties in the U.S. Uh-huh. Hey, the bell actually rung this time. That's surprising. Then is is the is the first one on there? Orange County? No, I don't know. It's uh, I know that's in California. The or something. one that New York. I think is the in. one that New York is in. I don't know what it's New called. New York. It's not County. New York County. And then I went to list of United States counties and co- and country country equivalents. Uh huh. Counties and county equivalents. So it'd be like. Oh, what? Knox County has the same, or like Lincoln, the county that Lincoln's in. Mm. I don't know what it's called. I think it's like Douglas or something. Something County. Something County has the equivalence of Lithuania or something. Oh, like that. to like how many people are in? And I'd be like, oh, so then it was just like a list of counties by population. That's oh, just okay. what I used it for. Yeah. And fun fact: Nebraska has a lot of the least populated counties. Oh, that makes sense. Because we have counties with like a hundred people in them. Yeah, because who wants to live in <laughs> Nebraska? <laughs> who wants to live? It's ter- I'm not gonna say that. I like Nebraska. It's chill. It's all right. Yeah. I don't. Th- Anywho, I'm definitely not gonna live here. That's probably the furthest we're gonna get because the bell just rang, as you guys just heard. Yeah. So, I think that's enough podcast for today. Yeah. But we, I think we could definitely continue down. We this can path. continue down this path for sure. Yes. This will be a good amount of like half hour podcasts. Yes. Just like us doing home room. Yeah. It'd be a good time. Wonderful. So. <laughs> <laughs> um. Thank you for podcasting with me, Quinlan. You're very welcome. What? Well, let me let me Jack read off an Schaefer. outro. I have an outro to read. Thank you, everybody, for listening to the Craft and Warrior podcast. This is Quinlan and Jack goof off. Uh huh. Quinlan and Jack goof off during homeroom. Uh-huh, we really appreciate uh-huh. your continued support and the fun stuff that not only Quinlan and I get to do, but the entire journalism team as a whole, of which Quinlan is not a part of. This, yeah, I'm not. You can catch us on Instagram at Craft and Journalism, TikTok at Warrior Journalism, Craft and Warriors on Facebook and Twitter, Jack Schaefer on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok if you want just me. Rossman, how's it going? I want to chips. We're closing up. We'll you be got any words for the masses? Sorry. No, you're fine. We'll be done really quick. <laughs> she does not have any words for the masses. Nope. Quinlan, do you have a quote of the day? Uh, it's okay if you do bad on a test because I did bad on a test. Okay. Yeah. That, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> encouragement. Yeah. Thank you, everybody, for watching. We'll see you next time we go through wiki pages. Yeah. You have, have a, a good, good day. day. <laughs> I wasn't feeling.